this actually. Ah, that's fun. I'm Walter Day, the father of esports, and you're watching Maddie Mo's Arcade. And you know, I'm not stuck by Black Bolt. I'm getting ready to attack. Fanny pack attached. Tokens are all stacked, got the mallet in my grasp Waiting for the moles, ha, hiding in their holes Scoreboard keeping tally, I'll be playing till they close now Can't nobody beat my high score You can't beat my high score Can't nobody beat my high score You can't beat my high score I'm a mallet master, a single fisted blaster can ask my baby, it starts slow then gets faster. I'm a record setter. My Random video clip with Contra playing in my ear and now yours. Um, I'm trying to get rid of a humbar and a Miss Pac-Man. Cleaned up this little uh, fuse block that's here. I cleaned this, damn it. <laughs> okay, let's see how we're faced. All right, that was fun. Okay, I cleaned up the edge connector here and the uh, edge connector on the board. And I'm going to check and see if this helped any. There was a lot of corrosion, or not corrosion, uh, oxidation on there. And then if not, we'll see if uh, we can unplug the marquee light up here, or maybe the coin door lights, and see if that affects anything. So let's go ahead and turn it on and check it out. And I'll throw you somewhere else. Okay, let's take a look at the... The hum bar, it's still there. It's definitely less. It was about two inches wide. Let's see if we can see it on camera. You can't even kind of see it. It's about one inch now. And where's the speaker? Let's see if you can hear that. The hum's definitely there, but it's not as bad. So next I'm gonna try. See these coin door lights are probably hooked up, but nothing's plugged in. I'm not sure, maybe not. But I'm going to try to disconnect these. If they're not plugged in, then I'm going to try to disconnect that and see if it affects anything. If not, then I'm not going to worry about coming back and letting you know. And we're going to move on to this Asteroids that's here. Um, everything else seems to work pretty good. I fixed this diehard monitor already. Just a quick look around. We got some more games in the garage to look at too. This is just a side job. And another slick shot. Another caveman, keep running into these. Another Saxon. But anyway, let's try to get rid of this home. What's up gang? This is not arcade related, but I needed to put a video out because I've taken a break for too long and this is what I'm working on instead of filming a good video. Um, this door is, uh, this is a, uh, uh, a place where I kind of work part-time. I help them out. It's where uh, Robin works full-time um, This door has a uh, Had a vent through it at one point in time and I'm at a uh, Residential care facility and there's food and stuff on this side and uh, What happened to the light? Okay, there it goes so They have you know the good food and stuff is over here and they had this nice vent on this side. Well, Somebody had got a hold of a screwdriver and took the vent off and got through and ate a bunch of pudding and stuff out of there. This is like 10, 15 years ago. And so um, they had these pieces of wood covering the hole on both sides. Let me see that. And so um, the problem is, is that that room gets real moist. The uh, Behind the walls is actually a stone porch. I don't know if we can see any. This is a really, really old building. Uh, I don't know that we can see any from in here, but basically in the, behind these walls is, is a stone slab where it's, you know, it's kind of like laid like brick, but it's stonework all the way around. And then that kind of sweats and lets water through. So it gets damp in here and they have to run, and this is why the audio is gonna be so bad. They have to run a uh, uh, dehumidifier down here because there's nothing, uh, no way for air to get through there and they have to leave the door open. Which that means they can't put anything in here like goodies wise because the residents can get to them. So I am, and here's where the arcade stuff does kind of come in. I'm using uh, sec security screws which, yeah, they use them in more than arcade stuff, I know, but uh, 
I do I am familiar and have the bits with them for that but I didn't really have any good material I was looking for this is the little maintenance room over here it's kind of got like this metal lattice work I was looking for something like that and that's probably what they used originally but out here in the sticks at the little old hardware store we were lucky to find some really th thick gauged uh, chicken wire so it wasn't really the right size the one of the problems I have is as you can see here this door is hollow there is a piece of wood here there's a piece of wood here there is none all the way around here so what I did is for the time being I just shoved some little scrap wood up in there and I put these uh, uh, wire cables in for what I do wiring and multi tapes and stuff like that to, to hold it in place and to keep it kind of uh, uh, firm I guess and taut and then I'm gonna have to do another piece down here because luckily I can screw along the, this outside edge and that'll be good and then um, I'm gonna put something like this and I, I don't know that it's necessarily gonna be this piece let me show you up here, it'll be a little bit easier. So something like this over it, but a little longer, and kind of frame it in so that it looks like a, a window frame. And then I'll put something flat across here, hopefully to make it look a little nicer. I'm just gonna use some scrap wood that's laying around. I worked on this for a few hours yesterday and didn't get anywhere near as far as I needed to get because I didn't have a saw. I had this, uh, but yeah, that's all the scrap wood I have to deal with down there. I had this guy right here with like no teeth left on it. And it, it was a bear. I, I was able to cut two pieces off of this two by four. And then I just used my, uh, my screwdriver as a chisel and just chopped off these little chunks so that I, I wouldn't have to spend the rest of the day doing it. But uh, this next step, I'm going to go ahead and do like I did here and just go ahead and finish up this bottom section. I'm probably just gonna do about the same size and let it overlap. And then on the other side of the door here, I'm gonna do the same. So there's actually gonna be a couple layers of protection in between the fridge and uh, the residence. So give me a few minutes and we'll put up a second layer and see how it looks and then maybe we'll start framing it in. So I'm at this soda machine, trying to get something to drink at the mall. And the operator left the key unlocked. So it's just wide open. I'm gonna get my money back. I'll wait till later. Let's go ahead and lock that up for him. Those are weird machines though. All right, so this is what I'm working on. I got my uh, little plug installed, switch with the light even. And then I have my battery box. I have a lid taken off right now. So this is a quick charger and I can put uh, 12 or 20 volts in there. And this one here is um, I'm trying to find the battery. I don't see it. This one's for my little hand screwdriver. I don't see that either. But, uh, so I put that there. And then I have my walkies that'll go here and here. Spare batteries on the battery holders mounted to the side. And I need to check and see if that fits. So I gotta, well, I know this part won't fit. Hang on a second. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Ah! <laughs> that ain't gonna work. Okay, so those can't be in there at the same time as this. I have to put that on there. Okay, nice, it fits. I had a problem before that this one was bumping into that guy right there and I couldn't shut it. But uh, I'm getting ready to do a couple little uh, more things to work on the cosmetics. And oh, there's the other fucking walkie. And then uh, I'll show you a little picture after that. Oh my God, that clip was so much fun. <laughs> and here's the uh, cabinet door that I did. I don't want to touch it. It looks a little bit, mm, light. it looks a lot more red than I expected. So I'm hoping that it, it dries more of a natural look rather than that cherry look. But 
If it does, it does. It's not a big deal. But anyway, on to the next clip. Yeah, this flipper's fucked too. Oh, there it is. Come on. That one's okay, but this is weak as fuck. Look at that. I, I can't believe it's playing a game. Yeah. Send a video to Lance. He knows. <laughs> Yeah, that's what I'm taking it for. I don't think he's seen my, uh... Oh, you are. Look at the display. The display looks good, too. Is yeah, that it's new? Brand new? Oh, okay. No wonder it looks good. I put a color DMD in a customer's game. In this one? Oh, okay. South Park. I got it. So it's a... They had only had it for like a year or two. It only has like 100 plays on it. Wow. That's a brand new display. This game's not even worthy of it. I cleaned it up a little bit. At least I tried to wipe its butt before I put the glass on there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw, I noticed that, yeah. So, we got a little bit farther on it here. We got both top and bottom done screwed in we got the latch back on i actually have some pieces cut out for trim here i know this isn't really arcade related but i needed something to kind of do while i show you guys these clips and break up the monotony and then that should look good so i'm gonna go all the way around like that and i got some stain going but uh Basically, uh, what do we have next? I don't know what we have next. I don't. I don't know what order I'm going in. So uh, we will go to another clip right after this. What is up, gang? Sorry for the shaky footage. Just got this. Met a guy about a couple hours from the house. I traded my Star Wars slot. He traded me this here. I got a uh, Patrick Mahomes rookie card and some cash, um, but I'm okay with that. At least I still have a machine so I can still take it to the home and, and uh, let the residents play it. And uh, I figure somebody else would enjoy that Star Wars machine a little bit more than it just sitting underneath my workbench. But we're gonna take this back to the house and fire it up and see if we can get it all working and play it up, stick around.
So these two right here are going to be ground and 5 volt. So what do we get here? Did I not turn the game on? I didn't turn the game on. I guess that would help. Hang on. Here it is. A nice little trade. The person I traded got what they wanted. I got what I wanted. And a pretty good deal on it too. Super what am I going to get what I want? <laughs> <laughs> that comes later. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's, it's on fire. What happened? Whoa. Lots of smoke. Well, that's bad. Yeah, well, thanks for watching. <laughs>